I bought this as a gift. If you want this oh as the winner, goodness. will you you want to put this on? So you put this on here? Yeah, that's yours. Oh my god! Yeah, absolutely. Do I look good now? You look good before, but you look even better. Thank you. We rolling? Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah, come on, get it, get it. Cheers, sorry about that. Um, Alex Polo, I've said this to you before. You're kind of a jerk mm. when it comes to winning. Like you never just Thank win you. by a little bit. You're never polite. You decide to ruin people's days. And if I'm honest, I love that about you. <laughs> you just stomp a mud hole in everybody. We'll get into the specifics about that, about how you did that. But what is it about you? You never win by 0.3 seconds. It's always this monster thing. That's a hell of a way to keep winning. Yeah, I don't know, man. Uh, thank you for that. Honestly, I... You do it. I, we just observe it. Yeah, I mean... I lo we love winning, so um, honestly, we would like that to come more often. Um, and as I said, a win is the same if it's by one tenth or by 30 seconds. But honestly, when you have your day, you just go. It's not that I was trying harder to try and pull a, lit a bigger gap. Um, it was just that everything was so perfect that um, I was comfortable. So I feel like sometimes when we finish second or third, we could have done this race, yeah. but being stuck, uh, there's no way, and it's tough to pass in IndyCar. Well, in IndyCar, in motorsport, when you're battling for the win. Of course. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. I like it. You look good in this, by the way. I know. I think you need to wear that more often. So, tire strategy was a huge aspect of how yep. today's race played out. You and the Ganassi side, your entry specifically, nailed it. Christian Lingard, fortunately, they didn't exactly nail it, but this wasn't just simply who chose what tires when. There's an aspect of your driving. Your driving style is actually what allows you to put up these crazy big gaps and win. That is, if folks watch back and they watch the race, watch how you do what you do, you make a hell of a lot of speed without loading the tire early into the corners, which then consumes the tires at a higher rate, you make crazy speed without beating up your tires. Is that natural to you? Have you worked on that to be able to do that? How do you do that? Um, yeah, I mean, it depends Give us on your the secrets. track. It depends on the track, honestly, but uh, I had to change my driving style a little bit to try and match Scott. Um, mm. I learned a lot about him. I don't think I was driving the way I'm driving now, um, like five years ago. But um, it's a constant learning process, honestly. Um, we've been working a lot uh, behind the scenes because we had some issues at uh, St. Pete and we wanted to improve that. And we've been working really well. And it's always about constant evolution depending on what you need, which is that's what's so cool about motorsport. But um, yeah, it worked in this track. But for example, Barber, I was struggling a little bit more than others on, uh, on deck. So yeah, depending on the weekend. Okay, we're gonna wrap up here in just a second. You're a member, crazy enough, of the Pruday listener there group. There was a lot of Pruday Amazing. members. Amazing, yeah. but the craziest one, I believe, was Chris Ward, who has a tattoo you of your gorilla. Yes. And then had you sign his, yesterday. Was this yesterday. Yes. And then went and got it tattooed immediately. Yeah, I, I, How crazy you're crazy, man. Um, I don't know, so he got the tattoo last year, I believe, or maybe the end of 21. Um, and I saw him for the first time yesterday. Uh, which made me really happy, honestly. Um, somebody that tattoos your logo, it's just unbelievable. And he was like, sign it. I was like, no, no, I'm not going to sign it because I know what you want. Um, but then I signed it because obviously he wanted me to sign. Um, and today one of the guys uh, sent me a picture and I'll show it to you um, of the new tattoo that he has, which is pretty impressive. Oh, my God. You got a lot of... T yeah, people is... Look at that. So you can see my signature. At least it look good, yes. honestly, because you never know if it's gonna be a good signature or not. So yeah, thank you. 
Okay, so you're leading the points, heading you here into the 500. Obviously, that feels good. I would think your rivals are probably not too happy because you're already consistent as hell, and now you're winning and winning big heading into the 500. You've been a threat in every 500 you've done. You're going to go home feeling good tonight. You're going to keep Very this, good. by the way. I'm going to keep earn, this. You earn this. But I'm going to keep this no. until my wife sees it, and then well, she's going to be like... It'll be, just take a photo before it gets thrown I'll away. I'll do it. Just tell me about the feeling leaving here you're going to celebrate but tell me about tuesday when with the real month of may that's starts. the real month of may um that's what everybody wants here this is just like a warm-up which is super important because it's the same amount of points but it doesn't mean exactly the same so um i think it's great for my confidence my energy um my crew's confidence i think they're super happy now um I'll get some beers with them and yes. some good food. So um, it's perfect to start the month of May and try and get the big one. We'll work as much as possible to try and get a perfect Sunday. Um, if it's our day, we'll be able to fight for the win. Otherwise, we'll have to keep on knocking the door. 30 seconds real quick. Yesterday, you told us that one of the amazing veterans who's in your pits supporting you, part of the American Legion, said, great job. But you're P2. You yes. gotta go one better. Yes. I'm guessing we now. know who you dedicated this win to. Obviously, the American Legion. It's the first win with them. We had a lot of podiums, which are great, but it's not the same as a win. I know for TV, they get more promotion. Everybody's more aware of the American Legion and the Be The One campaign. Um, so, yeah, Be The One, Dark Dork. Save a veteran today. Hopefully, we save some people by winning races and we'll keep on doing it. And by you being the one today, we're getting to sing that message even more. Yeah. Nice job, son. Thank you. Cheers. It's a good beer. It is. Yeah.